of Hawaii's most accurate weather with Kelly Simek. Good morning, everybody. Setting up to be a nice breezy day today. High pressure system passing to the north of the islands is going to continue to support those trade winds, which today are forecast up to about 25 miles an hour. Now, our trade winds are forecast to gradually weaken tomorrow before then coming light and variable starting on Friday. And that's ahead of a cold front that's coming through. Enjoy the trade winds while we have them today and tomorrow because it looks like we're not going to be seeing our trade winds returning potentially until next week, Wednesday. So we're going to have a long lull in those trades, so be prepared for that. Now, what we're also seeing is an area of showery low clouds that we've been seeing impacting the state since yesterday. A lot more of those, especially for the smaller islands, a lot more of those showers that are typically confined to the windward sides came over to the leeward areas. And we saw, again, a lot of offshore showers being pulled on shore. And that's especially true mainly here on Oahu. Now, we're expecting that once again this morning with fewer showers this afternoon. Our precipitation potential goes from about a 56% chance of rain here in Honolulu down to about a 12% chance of rain right at noon. Pops back up to about an 18% chance of rain later this evening. But overall, again, we are expecting some drying conditions. But take a look. Widespread showers continue here on Oahu, even continuing for the central portion of the island, and some of which are actually a little bit heavy. Elsewhere, it's kind of just the typical windward mocha showers. So everyone else saw a more typical weather pattern yesterday. Again, here on Oahu, a bit more of those showers uh, continued with us. Now, here's a look at the future satellite and radar. We're expecting some passing windward mocha showers. This is a look at the future radar through tomorrow. Now we're at Thursday, 9 o'clock, and as you can see, the moisture from that front that's coming in from the northwest starting to spread over the state. So although we're going to start out with fairly dry conditions and it looks like strong winds, as the day continues, our wind's going to be lightening up and we could be seeing the precipitation potential rise once again in the evening hours on Thanksgiving. So for Thanksgiving, your forecast, partly sunny skies with trade winds starting to ease off. For today, again, starting out with a lot of rainfall, it's breezy with gusts up to about 45 miles an hour as that high pressure system sinks a little bit further to the south. And then the winds are completely gone on Friday and not coming back in sight. All right, Chris, over to you.